What's going on everyone? It is me, Storm. Forgive me if I sound a little bit sick today, but we're going to be going through a quick video um, about that the developers have just recently uploaded onto Facebook. Uh, I'll have the link in the description, but before you go have a look at that, uh, I just want to show you guys the highlights of this stream that they did. They showed so many new things. What they just showed was a zombie that they're working on. It could be the blind zombie, but what's even bigger is this next part that comes up. If you look closely, the C there's a C4 explosion blowing up the level 3 walls, and you have AI with you that seem to be wiping out the base. So I'm assuming this might be the raiders, and this is what could happen if you ally with them. Next up, we've got someone on the dev team working on the 3D environment for one of these snow locations, and this this environment is not flat, it's, it's a wild terrain, so it's going to be very awesome seeing um, these new elevations, you guys can see there's a chopper there in the background, uh, there's lots of elevations there, and it's definitely going to look like a very cool location once it is complete. Um, next, we've got someone on the dev team who is working on the radio tower and this radio tower is massive guys uh, I don't know how long it's going to take to be able to repair this or if it's actually already an existing item or location that you just have to repair or constantly monitor uh, but we'll find out eventually. And next, they showed some new locations that they were busy working on. You guys can see there's two awesome locations on that screen right now. Um, I definitely do like the snow location, but that water location is looking absolutely amazing. There is, of course, the Kefir's Fidget Spinner, which is probably the mascot of the company. And then they show one more location, which seems to be similar to the first one they showed on the right hand side, but if I was correct I may have seen a raft over there. Uh, and then finally they show some gameplay of a snow location that seems to be just about complete. And as you guys can see, the character does not have enough clothes on and he is taking constant damage. You guys can see there's a little icon above him showing that he's freezing to death and that is pretty awesome. We're going to need to be able to wear um, probably the winter clothing or just a thick set of clothing that would be able to um, prevent us from taking that damage. But the location itself looks amazing and I can't wait for this to be added to the game and I hope you guys are very excited as well. That's all I really have to show for this video and I'll see you guys in the next one.